Paint and coating removal is accomplished using segmented diamonds. To install the segmented diamonds, remove any weights that are on the machine and place the unit in the rock back position. To place the machine in the rock back position, pull the handle out, lift it up to the upright position, and lock it into place. Push down on the handle while pushing downward on the foot pegs. Tilt the deck up until the unit rests securely on the back edge of the deck. To add the segmented diamonds, remove the drivers from the machine. Make sure any diamond discs in place have cooled before attempting to change them. Please note, a screwdriver may be required to pry off the diamond disc. Remove the screw that retains the diamond disc holder and replace with the provided longer screw. Use an Allen wrench to secure the segmented diamonds and disc holder into place. Return the machine to the operating position. Verify that the machine is parallel with the floor. If it is not, adjust the rear axle height by turning the axle screw. A small level will aid in this adjustment. You can adjust the pivot stops on the axle to allow the unit to pivot as needed. This will also allow you to apply slight side-to-side -side pressure when necessary. Fill the onboard water tank with clean water. This allows you to keep the segmented diamonds cool during operation and also prevents paint or coatings that melt during the removal process from sticking to the diamonds. Add the full complement of weights to reach maximum head weight. Before you begin coating removal, thoroughly inspect the work area. Bolts that extend above floor level can damage or even destroy the segmented diamonds. After coating removal has been completed, you may continue with the grinding and polishing process.